talked about the importance of bringing nature indoors and creating dedicated zones for relaxation. Remember, this isn't about a huge, expensive makeover. It's about making small, intentional choices every day that contribute to a more peaceful environment. Start with one small change this week. Maybe it's buying one new plant, creating a relaxing evening playlist, or just clearing off that one cluttered countertop. These little actions add up, and before you know it, you'll have crafted a home that truly nurtures now, let's talk about the other powerhouse of modern backups. Cloud storage. Services like Google Drive, Dropbox, OneDrive, and iCloud have revolutionized how we store and access our files. The biggest advantage of the cloud is that your data is stored off-site on secure servers managed by these big tech companies. This fulfills that crucial one-copy off-site part of the 3 one rule. If something happens to your home and all your devices, your cloud data is safe and sound, accessible from any internet-connected device in the world. Most of these services offer a free tier with a decent amount of storage, which might be enough for your most critical documents. For photos and videos, you'll likely need to upgrade to a paid plan, but the monthly costs are often very reasonable, like the price of a couple of coffees. These services also have desktop apps that sync your files automatically. You just save a file to your Google Drive or Dropbox folder on your computer, and it's instantly uploaded to the cloud. It's seamless and works in the background without you even thinking about it. For those of you who are serious photographers, videographers, or just have a massive digital collection, you might want to consider a more robust solution called ANAS, or Network Attached Storage. Think of a NAS as your own personal cloud, but located right in your home. It's a small box containing one or more hard drives that connects to your home network. This allows you to centralize all your family S data in one place and access it from any device on your network and even remotely over the internet. A huge benefit of ANAs is that they often use multiple drives in a configuration called RAID, without getting too technical. This means if one hard drive fails, your data is still safe on the other drives. You can just swap out the failed drive and the system rebuilds itself. It gives you an extra layer of protection right at home. While ANAS is a bigger initial investment than an external drive, it offers incredible flexibility, speed and control over your data. It's the ultimate home data hub. So, we've covered external drives, cloud storage, and a NAS. Which one is right for you? The answer is, you don't have to choose just one. In fact, the best strategy is a hybrid approach. This is where you combine the strengths of different methods to create a truly bulletproof backup system. For instance, you could use Time Machine or File History to back up your computer to an external hard drive every day. This gives you a fast local backup for quick restores. Then, you can also use a cloud storage service to sync your most important folders, like your work documents, family photos, and financial records. This gives you that essential off-site copy.
So if your laptop and external drive are both stolen, your critical files are still safe in the cloud. Or, if you have a NAS, you can use it as your primary backup and then have the NAS itself back up its most important data to a cloud service. This combination of local and cloud backup is the modern interpretation of the 3 2 1 rule and offers the best of both worlds speed and convenience for local restores and disaster proof security with an off site copy. Let's not forget about our phones. Our smartphones hold so much of our daily lives, from photos and videos to contacts and messages. Losing your phone without a backup can be devastating. Thankfully, backing up your phone is easier than ever. If you have an iPhone, Apple's iCloud backup is your best friend. Just go into your settings, tap on your name at the top, go to iCloud and make sure iCloud